द वर्ल्ड ऑफ प्लान्स वन हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम पौधमल हे वाई यू हैव स्टार्टेड लाफिंग आफ्टर हियरिंग माई नेम माई नेम इज समथिंग लाइक दिस दैट एवरी वन स्टार्ट लाफिंग इफ यू टर्न अराउंड एंड लुक अराउंड यू ऑलमोस्ट एवरी वेयर मेनी ऑफ माई फ्रेंड्स हु लुक यंगर देन मी और ओल्डर देन मी विल बी सीन आई नो दैट पीपल हैव मेनी मिसकनसेप्शन अबाउट अस स्पेशली इन द माइंड ऑफ चिल्ड्रन लाइक डू वी फॉल इन टू द कैटेगरी ऑफ लिविंग और नॉन लिविंग हाउ डू वी ग्रो इफ वी आर अलाइव वेर डू वी गेट एनर्जी फ्रॉम एट्सेट्रा Today I'll give you the answers to all these questions by the characters of this video. Let me take you to Neelu and Meenu's house. They have reached home from school and are playing in the courtyard. The objective of this video are to understand about the nutrition in plants, to understand photosynthesis. What happened Didi? What are you thinking about this tree? This tree is so green. How cool is it in its shade? It gives so much fresh air. Yes, Didi, it is. Its leaves are also green. You are right, Neelu. Didi, let's ask mother how she and father would have planted such a big tree in the front yard. Yes, let's go. Mother, tell me one thing. How did you and father plant this big neem tree in our front yard? Hmm. Your grandfather planted it many years ago. Then it must have been a small plant. Is that true? Children, plants grow like us. What did you people think that the small plants that are there remain small and that the big trees are always like that? Small plants grow up slowly and become trees. Plants are also living things. What are you thinking, Neelu? Didi, why don't we get one sapling? Maybe then we will be able to understand the various functions of a plant which make them living things. You are right, Neelu. We shall do one thing. We will both plant two saplings. Yes, Didi. One for me and one for you. While we come back from the school, we will take two small saplings from the gardener of the school. Oh, nice. Look at the two sisters. How happy they are. Each one has got a sapling each. Let us see how both will take care of the saplings. I shall keep this sapling in the window. I will keep this sapling safely in this room. Neelu look how these neem leaves have turned brown they are all falling from the tree Yes didi how come the leaves that are green are on the trees and those that have fallen off the tree are brown in color and look dried The world of plants is very strange Children how do you think these two girls will solve the puzzle Look Neelu Mother is watering the plants that are there in the garden. It is very important for the plants to get water to grow. Come, let us also water our plants. Children, do you think my friends require only water for their growth? Come, let us see what happened after 4 days. Oh ho, look what has happened. My sapling was fine till yesterday. Today it has turned yellow. Neelu, look at my sapling. There are a few leaves growing. Didi, why did my sapling turn yellow? Wait, let me think. Neelu, there is so much water in the pot too. Didi, you only had told me that plants require water. Neelu I did say that plants require water but it does not mean that you just keep watering the plants mother also waters the plants of the front yard only once in 2 to 3 days i watered the plants every day 
I feel that one of the reasons for the plant turning yellow is too much watering of the plants. Didi, like how we need food to survive and if we eat too much food, we fall sick. Maybe the same thing happened to the plant. I do feel the same way. Nilu, where did you keep your plant? I kept the plant in my room. There is no sunlight in your room. Didi, is sunlight essential for plants? Yes, if you notice, the plant is tilting towards the direction of the sunlight and it is getting fresh air also. It means that plants need water, sunlight and fresh air. No wonder the plants in our front yard look so healthy and green. You are absolutely right. The mention of air reminded me of what I studied in the science textbook. It is mentioned that we humans inhale oxygen and give out carbon dioxide. Didi, do you remember you were mentioning the other day that our neem tree provides a lot of fresh air? Yes. If we inhale oxygen and give out carbon dioxide, does it mean that the trees are also doing the same? Yes, plants also need oxygen to survive. However, unlike animals, they need carbon dioxide for photosynthesis. We give them carbon dioxide which is important for them. Now do you know why mother has planted so many trees in the front yard? Yes, Didi, I am comprehending everything about plants. If you look at these leaves, you will feel they have been painted green color. Only today our teacher mentioned that leaves have a green pigment called chlorophyll. Oh, that is why leaves look so green. At least we learned something from the teacher. <laughs> You are right. Remember Didi, when the gardener uncle gave us the plants, he had properly covered the roots of the plant in the mud. Yes, I remember. Only due to this, the plant is able to stand upright. Yes Didi, I was very curious to learn about the roots. I asked the teacher about it and he told me that roots absorb the water and nutrients from the soil and transport these to the plant. Yes, you are right. Similarly, these leaves are also very important. We have learnt so much about the plant. We will crack the information about the leaves too. My science book has a lesson on plants. These days, my teacher is teaching about plants. The lesson has extensive information about leaves. Wait, I will go get the book. Yes, Didi. Please get it soon and let us unravel the mystery of leaves. Listen, I will read it and tell you. Chlorophyll helps the leaves to store sunlight. That energy is used to synthesize food with the help of water and carbon dioxide. That is why the process of preparation of food by plants is called photosynthesis. Didi, by observing plants all these days, how much have we learnt about them? Looks like we have become scientists. By now, we have learnt that plants prepare their own food. And that is why they are called autotrophs. For the plants to prepare food, sunlight, air, carbon dioxide and nutrients are required. Yes, therefore do not keep your plant in the room. Didi, henceforth I will take care of my plant. Both these sisters have gathered a lot of information about us, the plants. But do you know? There is much more to know. Friends, do you think all plants are self-sufficient and make their own food? Keep thinking because you will find the answer in the next video. See you soon.